Imagine we could solve complex problems in minutes that would take the best supercomputers thousands of years. That's quantum computing, and it will revolutionize the way that we approach computation. So let's dive in and find out how quantum computing really works. Today's classical computers work in binary. Information is stored in bits, so every video you've watched or every message you've sent is essentially made up of these bits. Each bit can be in a state of zero or one, just like a coin can be heads or tails up. However, quantum computing works differently. They use qubits, which can exist in a state between zero and one. Let's say I flip the coin. While it's spinning, is it heads or is it tails? It's in a blurry state between zero and one, which we call superposition. Qubits can be in any proportion of these states, and by leveraging this phenomenon, quantum algorithms can explore a vast solution space far faster than classical algorithms. But remember, a qubit can only remain in superposition before measurement. After it's measured, it collapses back into a classical state, returning to zero or one. Entanglement, like superposition, is also crucial for quantum computing. Let's say I have two coins, and I flip both of them. If I read the first one as heads, the second one could be either heads or tails, since one coin does not influence the state of the other. However, if the two coins were entangled, then after I measured the state of the first coin, the second would be instantly determined as tails. So qubits use superposition and entanglement to gain exponential speed in calculations, allowing quantum computers to solve certain problems like Shor's algorithm far more efficiently. These advancements will soon transform various fields like medicine, encryption, and AI. But this future does not come without challenges. Qubits are extremely vulnerable to environmental interference like vibrations and heat, so their superpositions can deco here and they lose their quantum state. So while classical computing will remain indispensable for everyday tasks, quantum computing will continue to open up new problem-solving possibilities everywhere.